A lot of people online and offline are singing the praises of doing planks every day. In line with this, many fitness experts and gurus alike have introduced daily plank challenges to encourage even more people to get on board with doing planks daily. Are you new to plank? Do you want to know the benefits it brings to your body? If your answer is yes to our questions, then keep on watching this video. Because today, we will discuss what happens to your body if you plank for a week straight. Before we continue, a like would be great. Why do planks every day? Many of us may give in to such a challenge because of the fuss surrounding it. When you find your colleagues, partner, or family members doing planks and crunches every day, you are very likely to tag along for the social aspect of it. Although it is nice to exercise, such a move is the wrong way to go as you do not have a goal behind doing planks every day. You may start the challenge just to impress your partner or support your sister or brother. Unknowingly, down the line, you will end up throwing in the towel. This could happen because you do not have a solid goal that will often motivate you to keep up with the challenge. Knowing this, take the time and dig deep into why you ought to start up such an exercise program. In most cases, your goal will align with the benefits of doing the exercises. Let us analyze the benefits of doing planks every day for one week. Plank every day for one week and this happens to your body. When most people think of doing planks, they immediately think of getting a six-pack. It's perhaps the most common reason why people do these exercises. However, planking has more health benefits than just sculpting your abdominal area. Number 1. Sculpted Abs Of course, we will start with the benefit that most people are familiar with and that is getting ripped abs. When it comes to ab exercises, planks rank among the best. Most people compare crunches to planks when it comes to training your abdominal area for a six-pack. Doing crunches for a lean midsection is also an excellent idea. However, according to these fitness experts, you will have to quickly progress to another ab exercise if you want your crunches to blast fat in your abdominal region. In light of this, experts recommend doing the plank exercise. This is because it works most of your abdominal muscles including your internal and external obliques transversus abdomini and rectus abdomini. The rectus abdomini refers to the top abdominal muscle layer, while the transversus abdomini refers to the deepest abdominal muscle. However, remember that you cannot just get refined abs by doing this exercise. Good nutrition is critical and this is why you must watch your diet. Eating a balanced and healthy diet that helps you maintain a calorie deficit helps shed fat around your abdomen. As a result, your diet will shorten your road to getting a six-pack. Talk to your nutritionist for more insight on the best meals to help you shed fat or maintain a calorie deficit. Number 2. Reduced Love Handles Don't be fooled by the name, there is nothing to love about these love handles. They refer to the fat deposits sitting around your waistline. Some people may refer to them as muffin tops. These muffin tops are associated with various health problems, which is why you must aim at blasting fat around your waistline. Mayo Clinic acknowledges that an expanded waistline is linked to an increased risk of cardiovascular disease, high blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, abnormal cholesterol, and breathing problems. To avoid the risk of getting these conditions, the Center for Disease Prevention and Control CDC, suggests maintaining various waist sizes. Women are advised to keep their waist size or circumference below 35 inches. Men, on the other hand, are advised to keep it below 40 inches. Doing planks can help you trim down to these inches. The most effective plank variation to help in reducing your love handles is the side plank. It targets the muscles along the sides of your body, better known as your obliques. Number 3. Improved Core Strength Doing the regular high plank every day can help improve core strength. The exercise targets all the core muscles including your erector spinae, transversus abdomini, rectus abdomini, lumbar multifidus, internal and external obliques. These core muscles need to be strengthened as they help support other body functions. These include number 1. Reducing back pain. Number 2. Improving your balance, flexibility and stability. Number 3. Preventing your risk of falls and injuries. Another study also acknowledges that core strength can protect the spine from excessive force generation during sporting activities. It might explain why athletes are often advised to add planks to their workout program. Please note, you can only improve your core strength by doing planks in the correct form. So take your time and learn how to plank correctly. Number 4. Improved Overall Health and Fitness Improved overall health and fitness are also the results of doing planks every day for one week. These exercises target various muscle groups, making them particularly effective at improving your overall fitness. The regular plank targets your back and core muscles. 
Others, like the side plank variation, target your butt, hips, and abdominal muscles. Planks tend to give all these areas a good workout, which explains why this exercise can help tone your entire body. You also get to shed tremendous body fat, which is linked to a reduced risk of obesity and other fatal health conditions. Some of these include various cancers, type 2 diabetes, congestive heart failure, hypertension, stroke, coronary artery disease, osteoarthritis, and pulmonary embolism. Since doing planks helps reduce your body fat and obesity risk, it also reduces your risk of these obesity-related health conditions. Number 5. Improve Daily Functioning Only doing planks every day for one week can improve the functionality of one's daily activities. Remember that you get to highly engage your arms, shoulders, and neck while doing a plank. Your arms and shoulders are extensively involved in supporting your body weight. Doing these gives these body parts a great workout. More so than this, it also increases their strength, which helps you to perform better in your daily activities, especially in those involving lifting. Number 6. Enhanced Metabolism Doing planks every day for one week can also rev up your metabolism. That said, it does not rank high in the list of metabolism-boosting exercises. You are advised to incorporate exercises such as burpees and mountain climbers for much more enhanced metabolism. Despite this, there is no denying that this exercise can slightly improve your metabolism. If you want to enhance your metabolism without changing your exercise program, we suggest you pay close attention to your diet. For one, start by eating small meals and at regular times. Your body relies on regularity and balance. What this means is that when you eat at standard timelines, your body can maintain a metabolic balance. Secondly, focus on getting enough calories. Skipping meals will not make your body quickly shed fat around your abdominal region. What it does is negatively impacts your metabolism because fewer calories make your body's metabolism slow down. You can also further boost your metabolism by drinking enough water. Water is essential for optimal metabolism. Number 7. Improved Posture Incorporating planks into your daily routine can also help improve your posture. Many of us are battling poor postures because of the nature of our jobs. We spend most of our time behind the desk, affecting how we position our back, shoulders, and neck. In most cases, many of us end up arching our back and having our shoulders in front. You might have been told once or twice to pull your shoulders back and straighten your back. This poor posture happens when you spend most of your time sitting. Doing planks can help you develop better posture. Although you are doing this exercise in a horizontal position, remember that it is working the same muscles as when you are standing. It is explicitly working your back muscles and helping them stay straight. This is done by engaging your glutes and lumbar spinae, which prevent any back arch. Constantly doing this exercise helps you always to maintain your back straight. As humans are creatures of habit, you will find that you will tend to keep this back posture throughout the day, even when you are not exercising. Do you think you can handle doing planks for one week straight? Let us know in the comments below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.